Hey, what's up, you guys? Badger here from Stax Gaming. Long time no see. Uh, yeah, I've been busy with work, but I had just enough time to pick up a couple boxes of Power of the Elements. A very big set, very meta-defining. You can already see the uh, results of it with uh, Splite and Tier Limit. Some Exosister here, too. Uh, Math Mix Circular, big one, Morphtronic, Telephone. I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. You probably already know what's in this set already. There's been a lot of box openings, a lot of case openings. So I'm just gonna skip ahead and get down to it. Uh, I've got two boxes here because one is gonna be one that I open. The other is actually gonna be donated uh, to our tournament on August 27th at Evolution Game Center. Check out their IG. They, huge shout out to them. They're letting us host the tournament there. They do magic, they do Pokemon, and uh, they're just starting to get into Yugi, so thank you guys so much for that. But now, without further ado, let's get started. I think I'm gonna pick this one. This is the box that's kind of calling out to me. You think I made a mistake? Well, go on the 27th and win this one. Prove me wrong, I'm gonna be there. But one of the things that's gonna make this box opening a little different is that I kind of want to turn up the heat a little bit. As you know, uh, you pretty much already know what's in here. Like I said, Splite Blue is one of the big ones I want to get. The uh, Primeval Planet, I don't really want to butcher that name, but the Primeval Planet is also another big one. Those two seem to be really the big pulls of the set, along with Ultimate Slayer and uh, what is it? Oh, any of the Starlights. So. The box was around 75. I'm hoping to pull my money back. If not, what I plan to do is at the tournament on the 27th. Howell actually doesn't know this yet, but I'm going to ask him to bring one of the Pocky chips. You might've seen it in one of our other videos, but if I do not pull at least $70 worth, I will, when that tournament starts, I'm gonna be helping judge it. Uh, once round one is announced, I will eat that Pocky chip and uh, you will see a judge running around like crazy. So be prepared for that. So I am really hoping this box opening goes well. Let's see how it goes. So like I said, don't really need to go through the comments too much. Garura, Wings of Resident Life. That's actually one of the super poly targets if I remember correctly. That one's pretty good because it lets you kind of super poly some of the splite cards. Value-wise, I don't know how that's gonna go, but first pack ultra, pretty good. Also, the return of me not being able to open packs. So you got Melfi's tier limits, favorite contact. Oh, I forgot Neos was in here too. Neos gets a lot of good support in here. Favorite contact, at least instant contact is another one. Ghost Neos is a big one. My hero's got a lot of fun stuff in this set. So, like I said, this set has been Pretty meta defiant. Ooh, that's a big one. Sprite starter. So this is, well, the, the, what the card is. It's a starter. So quick play. Let's you bring one out from the deck. You lose life equal to their attack. Wow, that really, really is a big drawback. Most of them are pretty, pretty small, but it's very good. Staring contest. Stared at you. I, I lost that staring contest. Ooh, and a sprite pixies. I don't know which one that one is. I know there's Jet, I know there's Red, I know there's Carrot, I know there's Blue, so I know most of the main ones. Pixies is one of those ones that I don't know. But let's keep going. Rika Kong Kong. Uh, that one's actually pretty good for Rikas. Uh, but I think Starter is very good. Starter, I'm gonna have to see how much it is. So far, not too bad. Looking like I might be able to dodge that chip for now. Exosister Returnia, very hyped about that card. I'm actually going to be playing Exosister for this new format. Very fun deck, very reactive. It's kind of like, it's kind of like Evil Swarm. Kind of, not really. It's uh, very reactive to your opponents. Rank four, a lot of it. Power Tool Braver Dragon. Remember that Morphtronic Telephone I was talking about earlier? Yeah. <laughs> but this one, very excited for it. Ooh, this one feels thick. This feels like a thick pack. Let's see what we got in here. I think this is some of the magic. All right, let's see, let's see. Thick pack magic, thick pack magic. Oh, well, Sharon, not too bad. I don't really know how to pronounce that. So I'm saying Sharon. Uh, if it's not, feel free to correct me. Feel free to give it a thumbs down, thumbs up. 
like, subscribe, comment. I think a like is a thumbs up. Oh, there is the telephone, the boy, the non, the not hard once per turn reanimation. So if you have two of those, you could pretty much make any board you want. And a moray of avarice, very good uh, for fish support. Also aqua support, making me really want to pick up frogs again. But so far, starter seems to be the big one. I'm not sure what the others are going for right now. I think that might be all the ultras. So it looks like it might just be supers and secrets left. I don't really know how many packs we've gone through yet. Honestly, I've just been nervous. This is, uh, I'm feeling the heat being turned up right now. So let's continue. We got Mary Melfis. Ooh, Emperor Tanuki's Crater. Oh, that's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. So, so far, still not too much, but we still got a lot of packs left. So, I might be saved. You might not be seeing me run around on August 27th. I don't know if you're rooting for that or rooting for me to run around on the 27th. We'll see. Sprite Jet, big one. Is that the, um... Ah, yes, that's a Stellar Trap Card Searcher. That one's pretty good. So, yeah, sprites. A lot of rank two stuff. A lot of gadget gamer. Pretty good with the telephone. There's the telephone. We were talking about you. And I have no idea what that is. Grand Tusk? Moki Moki Adrift? It's still getting support and a carrot. All right, so it's looking like we got what? It's three, six, ten packs left. We've already gone through 14 of these. That is kind of ridiculous. Let's not damage the cards along the way. Uh, let's see what we got. Some branded expulsion. Ooh, that was a secret. Oh, it's a spell. It is a spell. Is it the primeval planet or the ultimate slayer? It's an instant contact. Not bad, but I don't think that's good. I think we're going to have to uh, pull a little harder if we want to avoid any kind of... Uh, Fiery, fiery tournament play. I mean, I still want fiery tournament play, but not when my mouth is on fire. Morphonic Earphon. I like how it's Neo and Luna in the card art. Let's keep going. Let us keep going. Mathmech Circular. Big guy for Mathmech. Uh, as I was talking about Exosister, Exosister were kind of the kind of speculated to be the evil swarms of the format. I feel like Mathmech kind of takes that over a little bit better because they make a. Uh, they make an XYZ Trish with a negate. That's pretty nice. Gunkin Ship. Still can't believe they're getting support. Oh no. Oh, it's a secret. No. Oh. It is a Kaleido Heart. Oh, that is not good. Oh no. Oh, is that it? Oh, we already got both of the secrets. I really wish I did not pull that until the end, at least. Cross Keeper. Now, we kind of have to hope for... What do we have to hope for? I don't know how much instant instant contact is. Kaleido Heart, I don't think is really that much. I know you only need one of it. So, so far, looking like this might be the box with the spice. But, that's good. My mouth is also going to be the one with the spice soon. Uh, Rose Diamond, doing pretty good there. But, let's see what else we got. Oh, yeah. Also, frogs returned. That was kind of nice. Making totally awesome is pretty good. Telephone. Always love the telephone. Scareclaw Straddle. I hear that deck is pretty good. I hear that we're getting a lot of support with that. Also, Melfi Wally. Pretty good Melfi support. Five packs left, and I think my fate is as sealed as this booster box because I don't know if we're tier limit. I don't know if we're going to be able to uh, get out of it. So, Al, uh, if you're watching this, which I'm pretty sure you are because I'm gonna be sending you this to edit, uh, <laughs> be kind, choose the one that feels like it's kind of light. Choose the one that does not feel like it's, uh, you know, uh, full of chip in the package. Because uh, I don't know if that video was released, but I uh, ended up hallucinating in a closet. That is no joke. I was hallucinating in a closet at Vegas, and you can see the Ika, the Flame Buddy. Uh, Flame's not gonna be my buddy after the 27th. Uh, but two packs left, winding down this box opening, 
And I uh, just want to say that it is good to be back. I do want to see all you guys there. So if you haven't already, if you can make it, great. If not, you know, there will be videos posted about the tournament, about the decks that show up. So it's not going to be too bad. We have a lot of regionals uh, coming up too. So we'll be able to see how this format plays out. Really seems like a lot of people's games, Splite is not as tier zero as it appeared to be. So that is kind of nice. But as we're winding down the last pack and it is a circular, I'm gonna go calculate these totals right now and we're gonna see how close we got. All right, now let's see how I did. Hoping that instant contact is pretty good. Uh, the card itself is good, but I'm hoping price-wise it's pretty good. So not Tactical Masters, kind of hype for that though, that Droll reprint. Power of the Elements, let's see how we did. Do we take the ship? Round one, do we have to announce it like that? Is my internet gonna load? All of these questions answered now. So, the product of the relevance, we're doing that, we're going from high to low. Okay. So, of course, we didn't pull Starlights. I want to spray blue at 95, that's not bad. Um, her, the Primeval Planet, 77, and I would have I would have wanted either of these two. The Ultimate Slayer, a little bit lower than I thought, okay. Alright, Sprite Starter is right there. That's our most expensive card now, I'm afraid. Uh, Kaleido Heart, so it's about $22, $23. Okay. That's about like $29, $30. You serious? Are you serious? I didn't even... I, I don't even know if I made it halfway. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Oh, for the love of... They're gonna have to... I was gonna have to rate this TVMA for how bad this box just beat me up right now. It's... 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 Last you good room, really? Anybody remember Punk? I feel like I just got Punk right now. Where is he? Where is he? This is horrible. This is Power of the Elements. The element isn't supposed to be fire. Well, that's been the box opening. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I hope you're going to enjoy on the 27th when I have to take the kit. Oh man, that is going to be the spiciest round one uh, start that we will have. But this is Stax Badger signing out.